Hey everybody, Brian Tro here, coming to you from Mossy Creek Fly Fishing with your fly fishing forecast. The date today is Thursday, the 23rd of September. So we're doing an update uh, because we've had such a big change in the weather. Um, what started off at the beginning of the week uh, with a chance of some showers has turned into uh, a lot of rain. In fact, even more rain than what we got in a lot of places from the hurricane that came through a couple weeks ago. So. There's places in the valley that got two inches, and there's places in the valley up on the peaks that got almost a half a foot of rain. So here we are, we're, we're pretty much flooded all over. We've got uh, guides all out around the valley this morning, kind of checking out water levels. We've been checking the gauges. Uh, so basically, in a nutshell, the large streams, the large rivers are warm water fisheries, the James, the Shenandoah, um, they're blown out. Um, we're hoping that we might be able to get back on the Shenandoah uh, by the beginning of the week. Um, but if you had plans to go float and fish uh, the James of the Shenandoah this weekend, it's going to be probably a no-go. Um, watch the gauge heights. We'll be back on Monday to update you. Um, but the river is chocolate milk and ripping. Um, typically, after a large rain, um, we'll send people up into the high elevation streams because they'll be the first ones to calm down. So uh, Andy's been out all morning. We'll be sharing some videos with you all from the Dry River, which is huge. It's a big drainage, so it's rolling. Um, and over in the park, several streams. Uh, we should get uh, some great brook trout fishing this weekend. So we've got a good combination setting up. They need water, they need more oxygen, they need more flow, uh, so they've got that. Some of the streams will be a little bit too heavy, a little bit too swift, a little bit unsafe for wading for the next day or two. Uh, but by this weekend, they should be really good. In addition to that, we're going to have um, lows in the low 40s for the first time uh, this, this season. So beautiful high pressure for the next few days, low humidity, highs of 70, 72, lows of 42, 44. That's the forecast for like the next five or six days. So we've got, you know, three weeks, four weeks, somewhere in there before the brook trout really start to spawn. They've got everything they need. They've got cover, they've got oxygen. Uh, get out there and really enjoy the brook trout. Give, it, uh, give those creeks maybe another day or two. Um, but if you had plans to go fishing this weekend, head up high and fish some of your favorite small drainages. They're flowing great. Um, Mossy and some of the spring creeks in the valley floor this morning are chocolate milk, um, one inch or less of visibility, uh, pretty nasty. So for all those folks out there that like to throw big articulated streamers, um, maybe by this afternoon, probably more likely by tomorrow. Um, even tomorrow, you're gonna have low vis, um, but definitely by this weekend, it'll be quite good. Uh, so for, for anybody who's looking to get out this weekend, it looks like the spring creeks and the brook trout streams are gonna be where it's at um, for the spring creeks big dark streamers, heavy streamers for the mountain streams. Um, they're eating attractors, they're eating PMX, they're eating all kinds of fun stuff. So you can probably just enjoy some dry fly fishing. Um, and then the smallmouth rivers will give you an update at the beginning of the week. So get out there and enjoy this awesome fall weekend. It's gonna be super nice. Um, and there's gonna be a lot of fishing options. And uh, October is right around the corner. So the state will be out beginning their stocking program too. And as always, we'll be here to update, to update you all on all those things. So uh, call us uh, if you have questions about this weekend. Um, we're, we're still out today looking at stuff. So if you have specific questions about certain streams, stop by, give us a call or email us. All right, have a great day.